Hey everyone, it's me, Nikki. Um, this is a weird camera angle because somebody messed up their tripod thing and had to try to fix it and Ken's in the shower, so this is what I got right now. But I just wanted to um, show you guys something that I did. It's not gonna be a long video, video guys, but um, I just wanted to show you how I put one of these um, covers together that I was talking about. And also, I wanted to show you uh, um, I stitched together a page for each of the journals. So this is the fairy journal, essentially. I'm going to put a label on there and, you know, stamp it like you do with the farm journal and stuff and fill this in. But I did that for this one. Then I also, this is what I meant by the covers. This is needs some work. Um, my sewing machine had a little bit of a problem doing this. And I hope you can get this on. I'm almost afraid to move this because I'm afraid it's going to come off. So I hope you can see this, but... <clears throat> So this is the side pocket for this journal, and then this comes out, and there's a pocket here, and this comes down, and there's a pocket here, and then, um, so that's, and the journal itself will sit in here, and then this will go like that. So this, these papers will sit in there eventually after I get them done. And so this side, um, has a side pocket also right there um and this side flips up and there's a pocket here I already put something in there so i remember there's something in there <laughs> and with a little tab and uh this side flips out and there's a pocket there um so that's kind of what i was planning on doing for the all of the covers i set them up that way but this is quite a pain in my behind, so I don't know. I gotta figure out a different way to do it so it's a little easier. But this is the outside. Of course, it's not decorated or anything like that yet. None of the pages are decorated. But I wanted to show you that. And then, so I wanted to show you the other ones that I sewed together like this too. This one, I tell you what, my sewing machine has a mind of its own. I think my tension was off or something because look at the stitch marks on there. It's kind of cool, but it's kind of different. So I'm going to put another a label on this one. This one is for the Country Bird Journal. Is this? Can you still see? I hope so. I'm so sorry. This is for the Country Bird Journal. And then, oh, sorry, sorry. And then there's one more to show you. And then I'll let you go. It is this one. This one is for the Victorian women, the Victorian Ladies Journal. Um, and I'll put a label on this one too. Um, I was thinking about, I want to work on the covers and stuff like that, but I think tomorrow what I'm going to do is maybe I might come on here and just, I saw a Shabby Dabby Doo Doodah, Tina from Shabby Dabby Doodah do a collage, um, book, like a collage scrapbook where you can just pull out the pages and use them as you want. And with everything going on, I just kind of wanted to maybe just do something with you guys. It's kind of relaxing and, you know, just fun to do and put together get rid of some scraps and stuff, and uh, maybe I might work on a couple of pages with it, some of the journals, but I'm thinking that's probably what I'm gonna do tomorrow, and I just wanted to say thanks so much for all the new subscribers, guys. Um, I really, really appreciate it. Um, yeah, it's kind of, a, I, I didn't expect that. Really um, thankful, and uh, got some pretty cool stories to tell you guys about the chickens too so i'll do that tomorrow but i just wanted to make a quick video and let you guys know um very um, i'm thinking about you i'm thankful um you know for your kind comments and for subscribing and um i will i'm gonna do something really cool tomorrow hopefully and then i'll get it uploaded either tomorrow or sunday so uh thank you so much you guys um i'll talk to you later bye